that you will open your Bibles to Joshua, the book of Joshua, and chapter 3, and verse 5. Joshua chapter 3 and verse 5. And Joshua said unto the people, Sanctify yourselves, for tomorrow the Lord will do wonders among you. Joshua le mani sarulai bhani, Timi aru aapailai pavitra banao, now, in this verse, there, first of all, is the instruction Joshua gave the people that you must sanctify yourself. And we are going to look at God's word and see what does it mean to sanctify yourself. And then there is a promise here. Joshua said, you must sanctify yourselves because tomorrow the Lord will do wonders among you. Now this means that tomorrow the Lord is going to perform a great miracle for you. But you cannot have a miracle from God unless, first of all, you sanctify yourself. If we read more in this passage of scripture, we will realize that the miracle was going to be the crossing of the Jordan River on dry ground. The Jordan River was a very great river. And God was going to perform a miracle for them that this great river will be parted and the water rolled back. And all of these hundreds and thousands of people would cross the river on dry ground. This was a great miracle that God was going to do. But before this miracle could be done, First of all, the people must sanctify themselves. Now we are what is called Pentecostal people. There are so many Christians in, a, in the world of different names, different Ra, kinds of Christians. There are the Baptist Christians. There are the Methodist Christians. 
They are the Episcopal Christians. Episcopal. Episcopal son. And of course there are Catholics. There are so many kinds of Christians. But what makes the Pentecostal people different? One of the things that makes us different is we believe in the power of God and miracles. We believe it's not enough just to come to church and sing and worship, but we should see the power of God do miracles among us. But too often, the Pentecostal people are not seeing the miracles and power of God. We preach about miracles, we talk about miracles, but we do not see the miracles. And I want to tell you this morning that we serve a God of miracles who wants to perform miracles among us. One reason we are not seeing many miracles among us is because we are not sanctifying ourselves. What does it mean to sanctify yourself? Now, if you will turn in your Bibles to 2 Chronicles, 2 Chronicles chapter 7, and verse 14. 2 Chronicles chapter 7 and verse 14. 2 Chronicles chapter 7. Second Chronicles chapter 7 verse 14. If my people which are called by my name shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven and will forgive their sin and will heal their land. Now this scripture talks to us about sanctification. If we are going to see the power of God move among us and wonders and miracles, first of all, we must humble ourselves. Humble people. 
God does not love proud people. The Bible says that God resists the proud. But God loves the humble people. You cannot be a friend of God if you have a proud, haughty spirit. My father used to say there are three kinds of pride. The first kind of pride, some people are pride of their face. They're proud of their face. We like to stand and look in the mirror, the looking glass. And we like to comb our hair in a certain way. Some women will spend a long time looking at themselves in the mirror. They want to look as beautiful as possible. Now I think that God wants all of us to look as good as we can. But we should not become proud of our face. So that is one kind of pride, proud of your face. And the second kind of pride, you are proud of your race. Or you are proud of your tribe. Somebody may say, I am a Bengali, I am better than that man who is in Nepali. Some people are proud of their tribe or they are proud of their race. This kind of pride causes many troubles. How many tribes fight with each other because they are too proud of their tribe? There are wars taking place all over the world because people are too proud of their race. So being proud of your race is not pleasing to God. The third kind of pride that God does not like is being proud of your grace. Your grace. That you are a very graceful person. Some Pentecostal people are so proud of their religious grace and 
and their righteousness. Sometimes Pentecostal people become so proud of their religious life. You cannot have miracles among you if there's pride in your heart. So the first thing we must do is humble ourselves. And then in 2 Chronicles 7.14 The second thing it says we are to pray. Pentecostal people should be a praying people. How important is prayer in your life? How much time do you spend praying? We cannot expect to have miracles if we are not praying people. Some years ago, I went to South Korea. The people of South Korea are known to be some of the most praying people in the whole world. When I walked into a home in South Korea, of course it is the custom to take off your shoes before you enter the house. And then the first thing you do in a house in South Korea, you will get down on your knees and you will pray. As soon as you enter a house in South Korea of Pentecostal people, the first thing you do is to pray. In South Korea, I went into the mountains. It was very cold. This was during their camp meeting. And in the mountains of Korea, I could see men and women Pray all night long. In that cold mountain, just like here, very cold. But men and women would spend all night in prayer. Then I went to a meeting on the campground at 5.30 in the morning. 
साढ़े पांच बयान को साढ़े पांच मास है जब हम उसे उठाएं क्या सेवा कई बार जब हम गए they had a special meeting at 5:30 रफ्तार को जो ये वाला साढ़े पांच बयान में जो ये वाला special सेवा का एक भाई रहेगा तो more than one thousand people gathered for that meeting रफ्तार सेवा का एक मास है एक हजार बंदा पनी बड़ी मात्रा में विश्वास के रूप में लाती है and during that meeting six hundred people received the baptism of the Holy Spirit अन्य देश समय में जो देते दियो बेला में जो छह सौ बंदा a praying church will have miracles and wonders. अरे प्रार्थना करने मंडली में से मेरा कि वो जो अच्छा मको काम रहा उधे को काम और जो देखना सब कितना था। In South Korea, I went to a baptismal service. अरे मो साउथ कोरिया में तो बाप्तिस्म दिन है सेवा टाइम आ गए। In one baptismal service, I saw 350 people baptized in Jesus' name. अरे मैं ये देख के त्यागी रह जाए कि 350 बंदा पनी बड़े विश्वास ये रहते त्यागी रह बाप्तिस्म में लेने को मैंने देखे। Do you want to have miracles and wonders in the hills of Darjeeling? ये तो पाई ले अब दार्जिलिंग को ये पहाड़ और वहाँ अच्छा पर उधे को काम परमिशन ले गरे को हिरनो चानुं चान। Do you want to see the power? रसी की माँ क्यों परमिशन को सामर्थ्य और वो अलेखाम और बड़े को देखना चाहने उनसे? The answer is we must become a praying people. यदि तो भाई चाहने उनसे बने देखी तो इसको उत्तर से यह हो कि हाँ इसे ये वाला प्रार्थना करने विश्वास की उन्हें बोलता सा। The pastor should be a praying man above all others. और और वो लोग बंदा पनी बड़ी चे अगुआर ने ज्यादा प्रार्थना करने पड़ता सा। some pastors are too busy drinking tea and talking. अरे कोई कोई अगवा उनसे देरे अभ्यास्ता होने से चिया आरु खाने बात और मानो मा. A pastor should be a man who spends much time alone with God. अरे अगवा आरु से यो ये सब व्यक्ति उन्हें पढ़ता सा कि जब जो से परमिशन को साथ मा एक लाई प्रार्थना द्वारा समय रुपिता होने. We need men and women who will commit themselves. To hours of prayer. Ra, ami chay yisko bhakti aur chancho, yisko istri aur chancho, jo chay ghanto ghanto chay prarna ma bhaytit karda cha. The history of revival in the world shows us every revival has started because of prayer. Ra, aza sara samshar ma yo iti hasik prakar le jun zakri ti aza dekhon da cha, yo zakri ti chay surwa bhayo yo prarna ko dwara. If you want a mighty move of God in Calcutta, Brother Daniel, it will only come when people begin to pray. Ra, yadi Brother Daniel karpa tamat se permission ko mahan kam bhai ko hero chaanun sa wani dekhi se yu se ki or prarthna arubar matra sambol sa. Brother Peter saying, seek him will not have great revival until Peter. And until people pray. Ra Peter Singh, by the Sikh Mandir, the Vera Sama Zagriti Aundana, Zaba Sama Mani Sarlice Prathna Gardena. And then we come back to verse 14. Ra Ava Ami Pini Yapta, Saudha Padma Hirde Song. They must turn from their wicked ways. Ani Aapulai, Dushra Chalar Pada Pharkanda Sa. First we humble ourselves. Ra Paila Ami Chai Nambra Udha Song. And then we pray. अन्य हमें प्रार्थना करने सो। The third thing is we must turn from our wicked ways. अन्य देश को पुरे चाहे हमें दूसरों चाव लगने से फॉर्गेट ना करने सो। If there is sin in our heart, यदि हम लोग इधर में पुरे पाप सब बने देखिए। If we are doing things that are not pleasing to God, यदि हमें इस तो काम करने सो जो चाहे तो परमेश्वर में मायने भी सही ना बने। We will not see the wonders and miracles of God. God loves men and women with a clean heart. The permission is that our suffering is by God. Man is under the steering of the angels. What is it that gives me a close relationship with God? The permission for that, that man, we are to submit to the Lord. It is a pure heart. The Lord says, 
अब परमेश्वर र मेरो सम्बन्ध चाहिँ परमेश्वरले नै खालि गर्दछ गड लव्स पीपल विथ अ प्योर हार्ट परमेश्वरले चाहिँ सफा हृदय भएको मानिसहरूलाई चाहिँ प्रेम गर्नुहुन्छ सो इट इज टाइम टु सैंक्टिफाई आवरसेल्फ र अब चाहिँ यस्तो समय हो जहाँ चाहिँ तपाईं अनि मैले आफूले आफूलाई शुद्ध पार्दछौं आई रेड जस्ट रिसेंटली अबाउट a great revival that took place in India in a place called Kurna ra maile aile padai the ki Kurna bhanne thau ma chai Bharat ko Kurna bhanne thau ma chai euta mahan jagriti goi reko thie the people in that city had been praying for revival ra tyo shahar ko manishar le chai jagriti goi niti chai dherai prarthna haru gari raheka thie they had been seeking god to cleanse their heart ani unhe le chai aapno hriday ma chai सफा गर्नको निम्ति चाहिँ परमेश्वरलाई खोजिरहेका थिए एन्ड वन डे दे केम फर देयर मीटिंग अनि एक दिन चाहिँ उनीहरू आफ्नो सेवाकायहरुमा आए देयर वाज नो स्पेशल स्पीकर र त्यहाँनिर कुनै एउटा स्पेशल एउटा वक्ता थिएन जो चाहिँ वचन दिने दे जस्ट गैदर टुगेदर लाइक दे ऑलवेज देयर र अनि उनीहरू सधैं छै उनीहरू यसरी एकअर्का भेलाहरु भए एन्ड ऑल अफ अ सडन अनि अचानक त्यहाँनिर चाहिँ द होली स्पिरिट लाइक अ विन्ड
The answer is there is nothing too hard for me. Relationship problem. 
Maybe your heart is not right with God. He is calling you to repentance. He is calling you to surrender. Those of you who need special prayer for a miracle, you can step forward. I I want to ask our pastors who are here to come and they will pray for you. I Pastors, pastors come up to the platform if you will. The pastors will be up on the platform. The pastor will platform. And these others will stand here. I would like for you to think about what miracle you need. Do you need a miracle in your own heart? Are you struggling with the problem of pride? Are you struggling with the problem of sin in your life? Remember that God has an X-ray machine. He looks right into our heart. And he wants to cleanse our heart. If you need healing in your body, we serve a God who is able to bring healing. It is very crowded here. It, there's a lot of people. We're going to pray together now. And our pastors will go down and they will lay hands on you. And as a pastor places his hand on you. You join together in faith. Believe God for a miracle. And remember our scripture this morning. Sanctify yourself. For the Lord will do wonders among you. He is a great God. He is a powerful God. He made this world and everything that's in it. And he can meet your need today. To seek the Lord now. Shall we pray? Shall we pray?